Hi, Ron Miller here. Friend of a friend passed away and I'm liquidating all the parts. Uh, looks like just about everything is Chevrolet stuff. Uh, there's tools, there's a little bit of equipment, engines. Uh, the cars are on a different video. Uh, two El Caminos and a uh, 70 Chevy truck in a Pontiac Le Mans or Tempest or whatever it is. Anyway, just do a quick video here. Pretty much everything goes except the refrigerator and the household stuff. Uh, mostly craftsman tools on the hand tools. Little shop press. Small block complete engine, appears to be fresh. 512 of the last three numbers. There's the date code. Edelbrock aluminum intake. Holly valve covers. This one also has Holly valve covers and a Holly aluminum intake. Mickey Thompson valve covers, Edelbrock performer intake. Exhaust manifolds. It's got a big balancer on it, whatever that means. This one's got the O2 low and the last three numbers and the casting number. I believe that's a date code there. This one's a standard bore four bolt main. With head studs made in Mexico, Hecho in Mexico. Date codes might be different on the Ford blocks made in Mexico. The date codes were backwards. Uh, this might be a 283. I didn't look up the bore size. When I mean, the bore size is under four inch, um, two bolt main. I am no Chevrolet expert. There's a big block complete engine. Oval port heads, I guess. It's got screw, uh, screw and studs and guide plates. This one is a fresh uh, short block here. 30 over TRW pistons. I'll go around and catch it from the other side. Holly carburetors. I did pictures with the list numbers on all of them. A couple cranks, distributors, some air cleaners. A bunch of cylinder heads, press in studs. Bunch of flywheels.
antique drill press. Bunch of valve covers on the top. More cylinder heads. Preferably would like to sell everything to one person on the uh, engine parts. Cars can be pieced out or sold as a complete setup. And the shop equipment can be sold all together. I haven't measured the bore on this short block yet. Here's back to the big block. It's casting numbers on it. I don't know where the casting date is. Maybe that's it. Here's the small block. It's fresh. Not sure if you can make out that number or not. One one nine Z three five five two six eight space larger print TO fifty two one H is in Henry C is in Charlie. Yeah, the TRW pistons are L twenty three oh four. 30 over. I don't know if the pistons are new or used. No idea. We got three speed trans there, four speed here, automatic. I don't know if there's any lights in here. Here we go. Uh, milk crates, miscellaneous stuff, carburetor parts. I don't see anything high dollar. in there. Uh, there's another shed over here. Okay, this is the last garage here. With parts. The 
This is for automotive upholstery, I guess, which I know nothing about. Fans, alternators. Exhaust manifolds, power brake booster, miscellaneous stuff in here, gauges. Bunch of radiators and air conditioning condensers. Miscellaneous parts and the milk crates. I don't know what's in those cupboards. Those uh, cupboards I didn't look at. radiators welding rod I don't see any super expensive parts here but then again I'm a Ford guy not a Chevy guy so those exhaust manifolds could be off a Corvette or something. I wouldn't know the difference. This is all stuff for automotive upholstery. If you have any questions, give me a call. I've also got lots of pictures of the parts and the cars separately. Thank you.